tutorial I'm going to show you the sun card. First of all, please be sure that you activate the sun column under the settings. Let's turn on the sun card and activate it. The most important behavior of the sun card in C Manager is that it always lets you control one primary light source per setup. So, how it looks in action? Let's assign SEN001 to the entrance scene. And let's assign SEN002 to the areas scene. Please note that if I'm swapping between the scenes, Scene Manager automatically turns on and turns off the sun which is relevant to the scene. You can select the sun by hitting the arrow and you can change the parameters uh, as usual in 3D Studio Max panel. But these parameters can be changed by Scene Manager as well. Let's go to this next setup and assign the same Sun001. As you can see, nothing changes. But if I open up the properties, I can assign a specific property for the Sun card. Let's assign the size, for example. Now, if I fetch the size of the Sun, from now on, Scene Manager takes the control. Let's type in a different value and as you can see between the two setups scene manager changes the size of the sun automatically there is also an option to control more than one primary light source per setup but for that you have to disable the sun card and instead of that you have to use the objects cards for example take that sun I make a copy for the sake of the introduction and I change it a little bit okay now I'm selecting all of the suns activating the object module and pick up these three sun sources let's say that for that setup I would like to have sun 1 and sun 2 so I turn on sun 3 and I'm be sure that Sun2 is enabled and for an another setup I just would like to turn off these two and be sure that Sun3 is active. So as you can see in this way you can have more than one Sun per setup. You can also use the daylight system. First of all, let's create a daylight with a V-Ray Sun. Now I'm going to attach this daylight system to these two setups. So I select the setups and I attach the daylight system. Now with the usage of the properties, we can make changes between these two setups. So Let's pick, for example, the time and fetch it. And in the second setup, I change it to six o'clock. From now on, I have one daylight system, but it works in a different way between these two setups. 